It's a very nice tournament. It's um, very well organized and uh, it's a very nice tournament to, to play. Everything is, uh, is, is close and uh, very nice courts as well. So it's nice to be back. I think that was a very difficult tournament that year because it was so windy and it was raining so uh, I basically played four matches in like two days but uh, I beat good players and I know it can be much windy here so definitely just to be ready for the wind. It can get a little bit colder always in the evening so just to be ready and patient. This is my first time here in Doha so it's a new experience, a uh, new culture, kind of a new everything. It's, it's really refreshing and really nice to be here. So I'm really excited to be here. Um, I haven't been here since a couple of years, so it's great to be back. Um, I really like the tournament, you know, the tournament is really trying their hardest to make um, our stay so nice as possible and um, it's a great location to play tennis, so I'm definitely excited. Finally, I, I feel much better, yeah, unfortunately. I had a kind of fever in St. Pete and coughing and so, so I had to withdraw from it. Unfortunately, I really like the tournament, but you know, the health is first, so that's why I, I couldn't play, but now I, I feel much better. Um, you can play in the, in the morning and uh, have completely different match uh, and you have to uh, try to adjust your, your tension, your game plan a little bit and uh, your game overall. Yeah, I think you just have to be prepared for it. I think you have to um, know what could come, uh, know what the, the variations could be, but at the end of the day it's just um, accepting what the conditions are. It's the same for both people uh, on the court, so I think it's just important to embrace it, accept the challenges uh, and just try and do the best that you can. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm aware of the conditions. It also can be cold at night, but um, as a player, I mean, you just gotta go. This is how the conditions are. You can't change it. Obviously, players tend to complain and, you know, want to things to be, you know, how they like it, cool temperature, not hot, not too cold. So uh, I just gotta adjust to it and just figure out how to play my game according to the conditions. I mean, we do have many of these tournaments, you know, and this is kind of preparation for the US swing, which it's two big tournaments coming. So it's, um, yeah, it's, it's, it's tough, it's nice as well. I mean, um, as a preparation or as a great tournament it is for us. I didn't play as much matches maybe as I'd like to, but um, definitely, you know, I'm enjoying my tennis, I'm enjoying to play and um, I'm healthy, I'm fit, so um, really, yeah, I just need one more, one or two matches, you know, to try to click it and, um, you know, I, I feel very good and I'm excited to start um, the tournament here. It's uh, extremely competitive and uh, you have to be ready from the first round to, to play very tough matches and uh, that's, uh, I think, what is, what is great and motivates you. Well, I feel February is a little bit strange month, but there is always these two tournaments and uh, I've been able to play uh, some good tennis in the past in this uh, two weeks, so let's see if I can do it uh, this time and, and definitely there uh, after this tournament, a little bit break and then these two big tournaments in America, so I think it's a good good schedule um, just to stay on hard a little bit longer, get some matches maybe hopefully here and then uh, we will see what's going to happen in America. Yeah, definitely it's important. I would say uh, I definitely want to get some matches in and, you know, go back to the beautiful desert and uh, do some damage in California. I mean, so excited for California.